This is such a heartbreaking story, but this 71-year-old from Harrisburg says he's hoping everyone else can learn from his mistake. Zeb Starnes admits he didn't think much about the virus early on. You'll get it in the last few days, and that'll be it. The retired postal worker refused to wear a mask until late June when he went to a funeral for a good friend. There were about 125 people at the small Charlotte church. There was very few people wearing a mask. They were not practicing social distancing. A week later, Zeb started feeling sick and first tested negative for COVID. But a week after that, his symptoms were worse and he had to go to the hospital. Of course, I was scared because now that I realized I was a victim of COVID, uh, I looked back and thought I should have been wearing a mask, but it was too late then. The 71-year-old was put on oxygen and says Atrium Health's virtual hospital saved him. When you're on oxygen and you're still struggling to get air, that's a scary feeling. But he says he got lucky. 25 others at the funeral also got sick. Several were hospitalized and six of his friends there that day died. A husband and wife died a week apart. Two sisters and two other men all died after being at the funeral. It's like a bad dream that we just hadn't been able to wake up together. Now he says he doesn't go anywhere without a mask. My, my message is please wear a mask if you're out and about. Because you learned that lesson in the hardest way possible. The hard way. The hard way. I learned the hard way. Zeb's wife also got sick, but she's doing okay. Zeb, though, is still on oxygen and still has a lingering cough. He says his doctors have told him that might take eight months before it goes away. Reporting in Charlotte, Michelle Bowden, WCNC Charlotte.